dear third semester triple stream students i welcome you all into my channel hope you are all doing well and hope you have started your preparation so i have started uh, the passing package series for you students today i am with your first subject that is uh, mathematics bee301 -E is its subject code and uh, sometimes bmat e301 as such uh, we cannot predict the most important questions uh, when i am talking about the mathematics subject okay rest rest of the subjects uh, we can take the super important questions so as far as mathematics is concerned so concept will be same but somehow data will be different so that doesn't matter over here when you just go through the concept when once you understand the concept you will be automatically able to solve those type of problems uh, so whatever the data vt will provide in the questions as far as examinations are concerned right so let us discuss here uh, the passing strategy how you can uh, pass the mathematics subject especially if you are a triple stream student let me discuss over here the module second which is curve fitting the simplest module from the mathematics from the third sem mathematics so first of all go, go through these straight line problems that is fit a straight line of the form y is equal to ax plus b to the following data so here i have taken the data x and y value 1 3 4 6 8 9 11 14 and 1 2 4 4 5 7 8 9 so data will be somehow changed but the concept will be same definitely there will be eight or seven marks question on this particular straight line okay as videos are available so you can refer my solving video on this particular concept just go through once and try to solve uh, the problems from previous year question papers i have already uploaded previous year question papers on my instagram account mosin ali 14 so you can search out and practice problems from those papers where they are right concept will be same so keep this thing in mind uh, data will be somehow changed right there will be little bit change in the data over there so next we have fit a parabola y is equal to ax square plus bx plus c in least square sense to the data so x and y are given values similarly you have to fit a parabola curve so also video is available on this particular topic i will provide the link in the description box where you can avail those uh, problem solving videos next we have here power curve that is y is equal to x b so at least try three three problems on this much concept that is straight line parabola and power curve so this becomes your 16 marks if you just cover these three, uh, these three portions next we have simple problems again problems on correlation and lines of regression and rank correlation why i have not written here the important questions as i earlier mentioned data will be somehow change concept will be same so that is why i have not written over here the important question so writing the questions over here makes no sense right this is the passing module and so anyhow you have to complete these five topics so that you can get 20 marks with ease so these 20 marks are just in your pocket i'm telling you so don't show any kind of lenience in the module second that is the passing module over here next we have another passing module that is module 3 i know for most of the students four year series may be somehow tough just because of the faculty reasons in most of the colleges mathematics fa faculty is not up to that extent to what students are expecting i know to be honest if i'm talking about myself in our college i was not able to understand one word from my mathematics teacher so i have read the mathematics by my own by referring the notes whatever was the availability for me at that particular time so i know this may be the reason for the students uh, in finding difficulty in four year series over there if, if they are not having the strong hold on a differentiation part over there as per my point of view it is a simple module and a passing module also videos are available i have made some lectures on four year series you can go through and try to cover the concepts then later on you can easily solve the varieties of questions from previous year question paper so here we have first of all seven marks which is which is the simplest in which a little bit calculation is there which you can do obtain the fourier series of y up to the first harmonics for the given data so data will be given like, uh, x 0 1 2 3 4 5 y is equal to 4 8 15 7 6 and 2 so there will be changes in this data only so this is a sure question which we will ask in the examination so this is the seven marks you can easily get it next we have another topic that is uh, half range sine and cosine series also seven marks question try at least three to four questions from this concept right so this is again a seven marks next we have a four year series expansion of period 2 pi that is intervals may be 0 to pi minus pi to pi 0 comma 2 pi minus l to l so these may be the intervals on these intervals which you will ask you you just expand the four year series right four year series expansion of these intervals for example i have taken here the question find the four year series of f of x is equal to mod of x in x is greater or equal to minus pi less or equal to pi so this is minus pi to pi question will be given in the examination hence deduce that one by one 
1 by 1 square plus 1 by 3 square uh, plus 1 by 5 square plus so so on is equal to pi square by 8 so, so these type of questions will appear in the examination once you go through the previous year question paper so whatever the papers i have uploaded on my instagram account so that papers are enough to cover four year series expansion just go through three to four problems on this particular concept so that at least you will grab if not 20 at least you can get 15 to 16 marks from the four year series expansion next passing module we have here module fifth it is the probability portion i hope you all are aware of the probability from your ps classes uh, like uh, uh, like 11th or 12th this is a simple module as compared to uh, 11th and 12th probability chapter right? so this is too much easy so you can easily get 20 marks from this module also also videos are available on this particular probability also which you will find in the description over there so a random variable x has the following probability function for various values of x so this is the question over here which i have taken as an example 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 and probabilities are respectively given what we have to find we have to find k and evaluate p of x is less than 6 p of x is greater or equal to 6 and p of x is greater than 3 less or equal to 6 so this is the seven marks question which is very easier one uh, i have solved particularly this question also you can go through so next we have explain the following terms some definitions are there which may be 10 marks surely we will ask 10 marks question on theoretical portion that is null hypothesis type 1 and type 2 error confidence limits alternate hypothesis and significance level right so these are two concepts now uh, last two concepts from the probability portion is uh, problems on exponential and normal distribution right next is t distribution and c distribution so once you go through these topics you can acquire 20 marks also from the module fifth so these three modules are the passing right first of all uh, module two that is curve fitting next two we have uh, sorry this fourier series portion next two we have this probability portion once you go through these three modules so that you will be having some confidence that uh, you can somehow pass the mathematics subject who are struggling i'm talking about those who are struggling in the mathematics subject. so, so for top words definitely they have to go for all the modules and also you can refer uh, rest of the two models taking important questions so now let me discuss here model first uh, ordinary differential equations so solve 4 d raised power 4 minus 4 d cube minus two, uh, 23 d square plus 12 d plus 36 into y is equal to 0 solve d square y by dx square minus 4 y is equal to cos of h 2x minus 1 similarly 5 to 6 problems from previous year question papers that are enough to cover this concept over here and this question is frequently asked in the video examination uh, from the last schemes itself from 18 scheme 21 scheme now you are in the 22 scheme so maybe uh, there are the high chances of this particular question so go through it simply have a reading on this in a lcr circuit the ch charge q on plate of a condenser is given by l d square q by dt square plus r d q by dt plus q by c is equal to e sine of pt the circuit is turned to resonance so that p square is equal to 1 by lc if initially the current uh, i and the charge q be zero show that for small values of r by l the current in the circuit at time t is given by uh, et divided by 2l sine of pt so this question you should have some uh, practice over there next we have solve d cube plus 6 d square plus 11 d plus 6 y is equal to 0 where d by dx is equal to d right next we have similarly here solve d cube y by dx cube plus 6 d square y by dx square plus 11 d by dx plus 6 into y is equal to e power x plus 1 and next solve 2x plus 1 whole square y double dash minus 6 into 2x plus 1 into y dash plus 16y is equal to 8 into 2x plus 1 whole square at least you should practice this module also if you are lagging behind uh, in the concept of differentiation so you can just go through the youtube itself uh, topics are available and you can easily understand the concepts so this is all about module first now if i am talking about module 4 this is somehow typical but i have taken here some concepts which you can easily go through and at least you should get 10 marks from this particular module that is find fourier transform of f of x is equal to 1 minus uh, mod of x for mod of x is less or equal to 1 0 mod of x is greater than 1 obtain the fourier cosine transform of the function f of x 4x uh, 4 minus x 0 these are the functions given and intervals are respectively given x is gr uh, greater than 0 less than 1 x is greater than 1 less than 4 x is greater than 4 and also obtain the fourier sine transform so so at least on these three concepts try to cover two two problems 
so that you will get 10 marks next uh, transform of cos h n theta sin h n theta sin n theta and cos of n theta practice for these two only okay if you are facing difficulties in this module if you are already good in this particular module then you can at least get uh, three to four problems on desert transform over there next if you are also able to solve inverse Fourier cosine well and good if not you can neglect this particular concept over here okay so this is the only way of passing your mathematics third semester subject by covering first three passing modules which are very easier ones later on you can go through the typical modules by referring videos on youtube so that you will somehow score good marks in mathematics subject so this is all about today's video i wish you all the best for your examinations make sure you will share this video to all your friends and batchmates who are struggling in the mathematics subject thank you